the cradle credo is our um, expression of some of the discoveries and observations and ideas that we have encountered throughout the years. Uh, these phrases seem to be uh, particularly helpful when we're working with, you know, a, a chin rest, a fully adjustable chin rest, which opens up a lot of new doors. And so it's, it's often helpful to start with a, a, um, as much as possible an understanding of what we want in our playing and what we want in our body before we start working with all of these new possibilities. Um, so the, the creed, credo starts with secure does not mean static, it means dynamic poise. Challenge yourself to find balance. There is no need to clench. Don't hold the fiddle, dance with it. And these phrases um, are really all pointing towards the idea that humans are naturally dynamic. And so any sort of tool or, or idea that we have that tries to fight um, our natural dynamism is a little bit problematic. And that instead of looking for a sensation of static fixing um, in order to feel secure, that instead we want to look for balance, you know, balancing the instrument on the collarbone, having a, a feeling of dynamic poise, like a poised position that has a softness and a suppleness to it so that we can allow our, our bodies to be what they naturally are. Um, the credo continues with, um, be a persistent explorer. Your body is the supreme guide, listen carefully. These phrases remind us to that, that violin playing is a process a lifelong process. It's um, a process of growing and, and, and gradually increasing um, our understanding of all of the ways the different elements of violin playing interrelate to one another. Um, and that ultimately we really need to listen to the feedback we're getting from the body um, because our body is in a way the, the ultimate judge um, and, and it often will tell us, you know, uh, this position doesn't feel very good or this isn't healthy, um, that sort of thing. So really, you know, making sure that we're in touch with what's happening in our bodies. Uh, the next phrases are visualize your holistic ideal and let no tool, idea, or naysayer block the way. Embrace your freedom to choose. Move away from reactive bargaining and towards proactive experimentation. Now these phrases, there's, there's a lot going on here. So visualize your holistic ideal um, is where we often start when we're working with the cradle because the holistic ideal, what we mean by that is, is like uh, imagining how everything is interrelated, however, you know, so how the chin rest affects where the instrument is placed, which affects how the, what the bowing motions look like, which affects the sound produced. All of that is very intricately related. And so we want to have as much as possible a, a clear understanding of, of, of that, that holistic ideal when we start working with the fully adjustable cradle. Um, not letting a naysayer block the way. What we kind of mean here is um, sometimes we might run across folks who say things like, well, you know, Heifetz put a pad under his suit jacket, so that's the way it should be done. And, and we often find that, you know, the, the problems with statements like that are that they don't really allow us to um, examine the the effects within our own system of playing so we always have to take the ideas of other people including our ideas uh, with a grain of salt and and figure out okay does this idea fit into this picture this holistic ideal that i've i've identified for myself um, embracing your freedom to choose again it's it's about um now with the cradle you have the option of choosing basically every aspect of setup um, in a way. And so really embracing that choice um, can be very helpful. And then reactive bargaining um, we're talking about here is, is the idea that when we go to a, you know, a violin shop, we might try out four or five different kinds of chin rests from a range of limited options. And typically, I remember basically I was just looking for 
the chin rest that was least uh, least annoying in the moment. Um, and so what we end up doing a lot of times is reacting to and accommodating what's happening with the chin rest or the shoulder rest or the instrument um, at the expense of our own health or, or at the expense of what our body would, would prefer to do. So we want to move away from that uh, mindset and towards one where we start with that visualized ideal and then we, we move the tools at our disposal um, in a way that helps us get there instead of reacting to them. We're actually changing uh, what, you know, th th we're matching their positions to us and not the other way around. Um, defend your right to play without pain. No pain, no gain has no place. Uh, these two statements are really just a reminder that, um, you know, an encouragement really to, to not... Um, compromise to remain open to the possibility of finding a place there where there isn't pain and um, celebrating those small accomplishments along the way and then the credo ends with um, some phrases that I find it helpful to remind myself of while I'm playing uh, we have crown of head reaches to the sky shoulders relax proud sternum shoulder blades hug the back, fiddle balances on collarbone. This is home. This is where we move from and return to. Now breathe. All of these phrases are, you know, seem to be very helpful for me um, to remind myself of what I want to see in my body and how to set up my body. Um, and we feel it's, it's, it's nice to return at the end uh, to the breath to breathe, to remind my, ourselves to breathe, um, and that can seem to take care of quite a bit of frustration, um, and really help ensure that we we are playing in and keeping the body in ways that are that we have identified for ourselves and are healthy. So hopefully that gives you a, a brief idea of what um, the credo means to me. And I encourage you to consider the statements in the Cradle Credo um, and, and, and even think of some others of your own invention and, and come up with your own Credo. And really, you know, hold firm to that Credo when you're working with the Fully Adjustable Cradle.